We live in a culture in which the most primal bond that should be present in the human experience has been ruptured. That primal bond that is so natural for us to know with one another, the primal bond that connects us to the whole circle of life in which we live on this planet. And then it is that same bond that connects us to our very selves. I ask, could there be any more important role on planet Earth today than to heal that primal bond? And we look to do that here at Sunrise Ranch in every phase of what we do. When we're gardening, we're looking to repair the primal bond that we have with all of creation and with each other. When we gather here in this dome, whether it's for a concert or a lecture or for a service such as this morning, we are looking to reunite more deeply with that deepest place within us, to know it for ourselves and our, in ourselves and then to know it in each other and to share it openly, to amplify it. What's happened in the loss of the primal bond is that there has been a loss of faith in the very process of creation. And so we become afraid as human beings and we think that we have to protect and defend ourselves, not just as a wise act in a given moment, but as a way of life. And acting out of fear, we think that we have to eke out a living. We have to manipulate to make things happen and can't have faith in the foundational principles of creation. Creation is at its heart and at its soul a spiritual process, not a mental process not a process of emotional manipulation, not a process of building stuff physically. Yes, it includes all those dimensions of our being, but at its heart, for us as human beings, the heart of the creative process, the experience of creation, begins with us very simply being ourselves and expressing ourselves and expressing our creativity in all the ways that come to us to do that. And giving our gift at the highest level of our being into the world. When that happens, when we're truly doing that, creation happens, the creative process happens. There is something that comes back in the working of the one law of creation, which is the flow of the Taurus. Something goes out and something comes back, and it all works, and it all brings life. But for so many people, the, the faith in that happening has gone someplace. And so it seemed profitable or expedient or best to do something else in your life than to bring the greatest gift that you have to bring to the world in which you live. When we give the highest of who we are, when we give our greatest love and our greatest truth and let that find its way in expression in our living and all the things that we do, We are setting in motion a powerful process of creation. We are in the process of healing the primal bond in ourselves.